Good morning and welcome everyone to another Subi Shares video with me on a beautiful day. Hashtag Team All Blade and hashtag No Blade Left Behind. You know how we do it on this channel. Squad goals, thank you so much for clicking into the video and hopefully wherever you're watching from, you have something cold and delicious and a comfy chair. Will it on in? Welcome to the shave. I'm thrilled to have you here. Seriously, the excitement in me is bubbling over. I can't control it. I can't keep it in. Today we're going to be discussing and reviewing the up and coming high proof razor that is made and manufactured and produced right here in the United States in Montana. This is an anodized aluminum pivoting head single edge razor blade that weighs in at approximately 21, 22 grams. It is skeletonized, as you can see, it is a well built razor. Check this out, guys. Are you ready for this? Ah! It doesn't go anywhere. This cap is actually held in place by a magnet and it holds the blades in the really tight, which is really cool. As you unload the razor, right? As you take the cap off, the blades go with the cap. So it kind of keeps everything in, uh, enclosed, encapsulated. Whatever you want to say, it's safe. It comes apart really nicely. This is a project that's going to be hitting Kickstarter here shortly. And again, it is anodized aluminum. It is a single edge half DE razor blade. You know how we call that like the SC slash D or the DE slash S. You know I'm a big fan of razors that use half blade and especially the half DE razor blades as a dome shape. I am thrilled. I'm really excited to see how this shaves. Um, I saw the project hit Instagram and I thought to myself, that is exactly what us head shavers want, right? A pivoting head dynamic razor made of really nice material that has a tiny, tiny face to it. So you can get around your ears and such. Really beautiful razor. And right now, if you go on to their Insta, um, Kickstarter, it's going to be um, released at a lower price than it is standard. But the MSRP is $135 for this. Really beautiful. I love the ergonomics to it. It's so nice and comfortable in the hand. And I heard the term. I was talking with um, David and Andy. And seriously, let's take a moment and thank them. Serious hashtag call out, shout out, and ma ma massive thanks to Andy and David for even making this possible. I was chatting with them and they said it's bomb proof and I totally agree it's really hard to convey on a pitcher just how durable this thing really feels guys it doesn't rattle it's not shaky doesn't fall apart it's really well built it's not fiddly it's easy to load you know the focus dynamic it's kind of fiddly to load this does not have any fiddliness to it. I'm really excited we're going to talk about it. I'm thrilled. It does have a small mark here. And that is the reason why I'm able to use this today on channels. This was one of the rejects. One of the ones they said, no, no, no. It's not suitable for uh, um, reviewers, right? It's not suitable. It's not up to our specs. Not up to our, um, not up to our uh, personal like quality measures. And so they said, I reached out to them and said, I don't care. I'd love to review the product. I, I I'll mention it on channel. So this was a mark that was, they, they, it was, it was a big, Razor, they said, No, no, no we're not going to sell you know, we can't sell it, we can't ship it out. But because I begged, guys, we got one to test. Oh, I'm so excited! Seriously, again, thank you so much, David, Andy, High Proof. I am excited to try this out as a dome shape today. What we've got is Signature by AE. We don't want to talk a ton about soap, but we are using a bourbon forward soap. Why? Because it's high proof, guys. High proof, right? And I love that their slogan is it's high proof like good bourbon. And like, you know, all things made in the USA should be high quality. I'm really excited and should be using AE on the dome today. And we're gonna be using some Derby Premium Blacks loaded. We'll make sure to have the loading video going in the hat cam frame. And the reason why I want to showcase the hat cam frame today is because it really does load super easy. There's a lot of razors that fit in this space, right? It's a couple of them, like five or six razors at this point that kind of fit similar to this space. But they're all kind of, they all have their own intricacies. Like look at the shave in it, right? You have to unscrew everything and take it all apart. This is super non-fiddly. One piece, you take the piece off, you put the piece back on. It's a two piece with the cap and the rest of the body of the razor and that's it. I know I talked with, um, like I said, I talked with them and they said that one of the things that they love about the razors is it can be left in the shower and it's not gonna degrade, it's not gonna fall apart. And it's not going to wear away. You know what I mean? It can sit in your shower. And because of that, they actually released it and sent it to me. A little stand, guys. Check out the stand. The stand is really smart. It holds the razor really well. Look at this. And it's just meant to sit in your shower. Isn't that fantastic? I love the little stand. It's super minimalistic. 
really small, meant to be in the shower, like on a wall, but it makes it so that you can just hang the razor. And I know they said the, the user, the guy that invented it, David, he, the person that produced the razor actually leaves it in his shower and he has for several years. That's how long the project's been being, uh, you know, thought of and uh, conceptualized. Oh, it's like perfect. It really is. I, I'm excited to see how it shaves because honestly, it's what we're all looking for is head shavers, right? That right there, pivoting ahead, dynamic. There's no skill, no effort to learn it. And today we're gonna find out because I've never used it, how it shaves. Let's go, let's knock this off. And we are using traditional shave soap because I wanted to see if it could actually keep up with some actual shave soap. The Derby Blacks, man, they are smooth in this right there. Oh, we good heavens. Guys, seriously, I was worried about clogging. I was like, is the lather holes gonna be big enough? Look at the hole here. I was not sure, you know, because the Broman flowed pretty good, but you know, some people had clogging. I am not kidding, that is beautiful. No problems clogging. We're on 48 hours. I actually waited, guys, to shave today because I thought this may come in the mail. I said to myself, I've gotta try this. Are you seeing how fast? I mean, I could go slower and really enjoy each stroke. It is so smooth. Oh my goodness, what? Yeah, that is incredible. For all of you out there that are like, how does it compare to the Henson? This flat face on it is actually slightly similar. Look at that face. It actually has a little bit of pull to it, like a little bit of um, like suction effect. And as, you're, as it's sucking down, can you see, I don't know if you, you guys can't hear it because it doesn't click, but it actually pivots really smoothly. Oh my goodness heavens, that is freaking awesome. Look at this. Look at the efficiency here. 48 hours, no problems as a dome shave. Smooth. I mean, it is really, it is buttery smooth. Look at this. Oh, oh, this guy's is worth it. Absolutely. Oh, is a head shave. If you're a person that does not mind a non-traditional head shave, right? You don't have to have the DE um, safety razor. You don't want, you don't care if you have that fill. And you just want to get a good, no brain, just easy mode head shave. This is awesome. Oh, we're in for a treat. Welcome to the new shave universe here. I have a feeling we're going to see a lot of these come uh, October when this release. So this is going to drop on the 10th over on Kickstarter. And then December is when they're going to start their shooting for releases. I have a feeling we're going to see a lot of these going up on Shave of the Days, especially on Head Shavers over on Facebook, because this is easy. Yeah, that I'm, I'm, I'm actually really shocked. I was, I thought I actually reached out to him. I said, you know, I understand sometimes Kickstarter stuff's not always, you know, completely dialed in. So I said, you know, what's what's in the pipeline? Do you guys have any um, other ideas? And they kind of laughed and like, just try it out. I honestly, I'm shocked. I cannot believe it's this well polished. Right, right, going to Kickstarter. It's this polished. This is fantastic. Yeah, really nice. Really, really, really easy to use. Really nice, absolutely incredible. Oh my goodness. I can't believe how easy this is to shave with. It is pretty efficient. So I know everybody out there right now, you're asking a couple questions. How does it shave as far as efficiency goes? I would say it's probably a five. I would say it's, it's not super ultra efficient, but I'm getting a very close, look at the stubble coming off of that. And I wanna showcase that. Look at the stubble coming off. It is still efficient enough. I am having no problems as far as ergonomics because everybody wants to know if it's slippery. It is not that slippery. I'm surprised. I don't know if it's because it's the matte anodized aluminum. What is going on here? But it is not slippery. It's definitely not super ultra aggressive. It's smooth. It does not have like that traditional um, aluminum feel to it. It actually feels a little bit more polished or smooth. I, I, I can't explain it. It's a little smoother than traditional aluminum fills at least on my skin because I don't usually love the fill of aluminum, but this isn't bad at all. And look what it's doing. Oh, yeah, this right here, I have a strong feeling we're gonna see a lot of it. I am thrilled to be able to showcase it. And I'm, I'm getting a beautiful, fast, just absolutely accurate. You guys see this? Look at this, it's zero effort. <laughs> 
I can do strokes like this that I usually can't pull off. <laughs> it's so good and easy. Um, yeah, I I am absolutely thrilled to be part of the project. I mentioned to him, I let him know. I was like, I don't care. I will be backing it for sure. And they're going to do an early bird backing special. And I definitely, definitely am going to be backing the, prog um, the product and the project. And I'm going to keep a really close eye on it. I want to see what else they can come up with. I want to see where this little guy goes because, oh my goodness, look at this. It takes the lather off, no problems. I actually feel like this razor would do really good with like shave cream. I really do. I think it would do fantastic it, because it, it really does like kind of buffer it for you. It's, <laughs> it's so smooth. Get out of town. Okay, underneath the rainbow. Seriously, we, we talk about it on channel once in a while. Once in a while. We got ourselves a marshmallow only. This is definitely fantastic. If you if you're considering getting yourself a pivoting head or a razor that's dynamic that does some of the work for you, seriously take a moment, jump over their website and can and take a look. It is absolutely fantastic. Oh, I cannot believe this. I am just blown away. I love that it's not fiddly. I love that it's not fiddly to load. It it stays together. It doesn't rattle apart. It feels really nice, really. It actually feels very, very premium to me. I, I, I don't say that a lot about aluminum razors. That it doesn't feel. Most of them don't feel premium, right? Most of them feel like they're the budgetary kind of shaver. This does not feel that way at all. I mean, I love that I can actually go in and buff. Yeah, this is awesome. Wow, what a shave! Absolutely bonker shave right here. Bonkers! Oh my goodness! Fan freaking tastic! I love it. Can't even lie. I absolutely love the way that this shaves. I'm just really blown away. This is fantastic. Seriously, David, Andy, wow! Holy cow! Is a head shave? <laughs> glass, absolutely glass. Not a single nick. No irritation whatsoever beautiful comfortable accurate close shave and it's done guys with the pivot in aluminum anodized aluminum right here in the united states i love that i know that a lot of us want to support little companies especially ones that are doing all their own manufacturing and assembly and all of the work here in the united states here domestically this right here hits all those levels it even says it right on the bottom which i really liked i thought it was cool Oh, what an amazing, I love that the face is actually flat and then it's beveled here. Can you see that bevel? It's very comfortable to hold. Wow, yeah, that is close. And these were the Derby Premium Blacks. I know you can get even more performance switching to like a Persona or a sharper blade, like a feather. But today I wanted to go with the blades that I know and trust. I just wanted to see how it felt. It's really nice, wow. Yeah, that is beyond close. It is subdermal, laser close. Right there, laser close. Oh, that was great. I've got to use this more. You know, this is the first shape, right? I've never put that to my skin before. I can't wait to see what else we can do with it. That was fantastic. Oh, awesome shave. Seriously fantastic. If you're looking, again, for a pivoting dynamic headed razor, this, this should be a high point contender. I really feel that way. It's... From the first shave, extremely close, very comfortable, really easy. Reach how fast I went. Thank you so much again for joining me. This was amazing. Ah, we smell like good, like we smell like strong bourbon smell. And that's what you expect with the high proof kind of situation, right? The high proof shave. Wow. Again, that's all I have to say. <laughs> Subi's results. Wow. This was awesome. Thanks again for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next Subi Shaves video. Subi's going to enjoy this perfect shave. I'm out.